Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft 1.19 All Advancements. Uh, I did dig in a little bit into the overlay for the All Advancements thing, and I've opted against it. I actually don't think it's very helpful to have displayed. It doesn't really give too much detail. It's just a bunch of like scrolling advancement icons on the screen. I think it's actually kind of distracting. So what we can always do is when we want to just get a brief little recap of how things are looking, we will just enable this. You can see it. And then we can hide it again afterwards. Also, eight hour world record now off the bat. Only only took a day for a thing to populate in there. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Pretty gnarly. Anyway, so today I want to go to the nether. So why don't we go ahead and do that? I can't remember if I uh, made a flint and steel yet. I don't think I made a flint and steel. So we just need to go and find ourselves a little bit of gravel, get started, and then find a place to put the... Portal, which I can always move later. I'm, I'm thinking for now, probably, I guess we could do it up a level, maybe? Do we want to do the, do we want to do the portal up a level? Or do we want to do it up two levels? Just to be sure that we're not hearing it whoosh, 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 all the time. Although, I guess if I'm, no, actually, if I'm up super high, I'm going to spawn super high in the nether, and it's potentially going to be kind of annoying because they're already really high up here and then I'm just gonna be like, oh cool, really high up here and that's just kind of whatever. So maybe I'll make it down. Maybe I'll make it down. We can always move it later on once we've established the portal on the other side and stuff like that. So yeah, let's do that. What if we made a little um underground area or something like that just so that we don't hear the portal or something maybe? Also, I actually, so it's interesting, I saw some comments um, on the first episode when it went up on Captain Sparkles 2 that were like saying, you actually liked it not having the gamma set super high. You like the ambience. And I can see that for the ancient city, like it's kind of cool having, um, you know, having that darkness for the, for the spooky effect and stuff like that. So I haven't changed anything. I haven't adopted, there are solutions that people were giving me like how to make it so that the gamma uh, adjustment can actually happen, and I have not, I haven't done any changes. So, for now, Gamma is staying at, at the stock value of one. Um, and we'll see. Maybe I keep it that way, maybe I don't. Um, we're gonna, it's, obviously there are gonna be people who are like, is there, I really like having the extra visibility from having the Gamma. Other people are gonna be like, oh, this is cool. I like that it's, you know, we get that more dynamic range of, of, uh, visuals and, and brightness and stuff. I don't know. I don't know, dude. I don't know. I have no idea. We'll figure it out. Why am I mining that way? That's going to make it harder for me to get back up. That's not very smart. I should do that. I should stick to a direction here. Maybe I'll just stick to like this direction or something. Something like that, perhaps, rather than, I don't know why I mined this area out. It seems kind of silly. Anyway, uh, this video is brought to you by our sponsor, the like button, and uh, make sure that you check it out. Give it a click down below the video in order to help us get to our target goal of um, 69 likes on this new episode of Minecraft uh, 1.19 All Advancements. That's a funny number. Where did he come up with that one? That's a pretty nice goal to have for a target of likes and, and stuff. Like that. Also, um, in case you didn't know, I mentioned it in the past few videos, but there is a new quality content drop. It is available uh, now at qualitycontent.com. If you go to the link in the description or below the stream, wherever you're watching, you can get the new night call drop. And um, the it is glow in the dark print ink, which is pretty cool and stuff. So, you know, if you're like out in the sun, you have to charge the ink which I learned with the first Cyber Noir quality content drop, how glow in the dark works, because I didn't know, because I'm dumb. You have to, like, it has to be under light for a little bit of time, and then when it goes into the dark, then it'll glow more dramatically than it would if it hasn't been exposed to light before. So that's how glow in the dark works. You gotta charge it. You gotta charge it. So it's it's pretty slick. Um, oh, God, it's gotta be an even width, doesn't it, for the portal, in order for the portal to be centered. So I guess we'll do this and stuff and things. Then we'll go into the nether, and then we're, it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna have, like such cool nether adventures and things like that. So yeah, check it out. Here's the thing, hold on, I gotta do the thing really quickly where I, I show you how it looks and, and stuff. And there it is, all right, you can see the back. Wow, isn't that so cool? Hopefully it's relatively in focus and whatnot. Um, 
not really. It isn't because I forgot to. I forgot to. Every time I turn the camera back on, I forget to hit the button that causes it to go into autofocus. But um, yep. Anyway, you you get it. It's cool. It's cool. You can see well enough. Um. Okay. This is probably big enough for now. I think. All right. We got that. And uh, yeah, this can be like our temporary Nether portal location, and hopefully. We won't hear it up top, and then if I ever want to move, like, we could move it, but also, remember, like, actually, it's really funny. One of the top comments that I saw on the first episode was someone who was like, I really hope he doesn't just spend, like, three episodes base building on this thing, and I hope that he just focuses on getting the advancements, and I was like, oh, I see, okay, I see, um, got it, got it, all righty then, so maybe the nether portal will just stay here and it was upvoted it had some upvotes on it it wasn't just a standalone comment that's why it was like near the top of the video was it, or near the top of the comment section is because it had other people who were agreeing with it and upvoting it and stuff like that and i was like ah i see got it okay noted duly duly noted um uh-huh but you're slow running you're slow ruining <laughs> well if that was a freudian slip autocorrect right there not slow running slow ruining you're slow ruining, dude. That's what YouTube thinks I'm doing with my main channel. <laughs> slow ruining. And that's how the algorithm treats it. Um, anyway. <laughs> uh, what are we? So, I mean, I could just, maybe this will just be like a blocks chest or something like that, perhaps, or something. And then I was putting vines over here. I should make maybe a new axe and a new shovel or something like that. Autocorrect was just being honest. That's all. Um, or, or I could make a diamond axe. Or I could make a diamond axe and a diamond shovel. Or I could make a diamond axe and a diamond hoe. I'll make a diamond axe. We'll do that. We'll do that to get rolling with things. And then we'll do another iron shovel. Got a lot of iron, at least. That's pretty popping off for us. Which we're going to need to make a beacon at some point anyway. So it doesn't hurt to have. And there we are. There we are. Cool. Boom. Diamundo axe and a new cheval, even though that's not really going to be necessary in the nether. But we'll put that stuff in there. You guys, you guys like base building? Here's the thing. Okay, what what is popular? Well, not be popular if I did it, but who knows? Maybe I'll try it at some point. What is what, so Minecraft let's plays these days that that do well episode after episode? It's a few things. One, the they don't really come across as episodes in a series in the way that they are presented via title and thumbnail other than really having like they'll have the number in the corner of the thumbnail and it'll say like Minecraft hardcore At some point they're always hardcore um it's more the focus is on like each episode has some kind of mega project that is very striking to have appear in the thumbnail and so that mega project and the fact that it's kind of titled and thumbnail to be focused on it rather than the fact that this is some part of the episode in the series, that uh, that is what allows those Let's Plays to kind of still work as an episodic thing. Um, but in the old way, which like you look at ultra modded survival or, you know, the original survival series where it's like the same thumbnail, but just the number is incremented and everything. And it's just such and such Minecraft Let's Play episode x that that does not that does not work each episode even if it is part of a series where am i gonna do i have a mob drop chest i don't have a mob drop chest um each episode even if it is part of a greater series has to look like it's its own thing um so that is definitely part of it and uh but that but to be fair the mega projects are like very very impressive um so that's like definitely a Step, I'm, I look at the ones, I look at the things that people do, and I'm like, that's, okay. Yeah, you, you worked hard on that. That's, that's cool. That's cool what you've done there. No, that's definitely, that's pretty cool. Well done. Well, I don't know even if I wanted, even if I wanted to be able to try to build something like that, I don't know if I could. So, well played. Um, I'm gonna need a misc chest. I need to get some more wood, and also the gravel, obviously, before we head into the uh, nether. But yeah, no, it's it's like obviously that's a super super crazy time consuming, yeah. Um 
Okay, I need to get uh, I need to get more wood. Let me just get some oak wood from over here. No, like some of these projects, they're, they're like you know, it's like draining out the the ocean and and making a whole farm out of the uh, the underwater monument and uh, you know bringing the entire Nether into the overworld or destroying the entire main end island and making a build out of it or something like that. It's like that sort of stuff. Super super catchy on on what it looks like what the end result looks like um and i'm just like i can't build that way like i can't i can't do that i don't know how you do that because i'm just not good enough um yeah it's uh but it's definitely like people be good at stuff dude people be good at stuff the competition the bar the bar has is raised it's been elevated significantly over the last 10 years or so um, yeah. All right. And you can't even, you can't even be like, oh, they obviously did some off-camera mining, because they, like, straight up, they show things, the time-lapse, that you know, the things that they're doing. And I'm like, whew, you guys are, that's, that's a lot of, whew, that's a lot of stuff, man. Um, that's a lot that you've done. Anyway, I can't keep up. I'm just an old, old fogey. Um, anyway, all right, let me, ooh, I don't want to get rid of that one, though, and this one, oh, that's where I'm building up, and this is my entrance, where do I put more chests? I need, I need to put chests in different locations, or something, maybe, like, maybe I'll just start surrounding the area in chests, we'll do that, and then it's just gonna be mildly inconvenient and annoying trying to track, like, where I've put everything, but it'll be fine, this is where I put the music disc fragment. This will be the deep dark chest. Sure, great. This, do I have a wood chest? Am I gonna make a wood chest? Yeah, they, I have a wood chest, cool. I'll bring some wood into the nether and um, we've got our boots with frost walker, which is definitely gonna be um, utilized while we're in the nether and uh, yeah. Okay, I need the gravel, I need the gravel. Yeah, I need to, hold on, do I have much string? I have two string, so no, I need more string. And a lot more string to stop all these vines from dropping. Anyway, okay. Uh, let's go grab some gravel. Hopefully we can find some pretty easily. And then we'll go to the nether. Re-rack your trees. Re-rack your trees. Re-rack them. It'll be very interesting at the end of this to compare, like, how many episodes I've taken versus Feinberg's eight-hour time, which will probably be less by the time that we, by the time we finish this series, we'll be like every couple days, we'll just watch as that time shrinks gradually. And by the by the time we're done with the series, it's gonna be like five hours or something like that. And it's gonna, oh, okay, that's that's cool. Well done, well done. It, that's that's cool. That's yeah, no, fine, great. Uh, let me go down to the let me go down to the river. Oh wait, oh I can walk on magma with Frostwalker. Oh, true dat, bro. True dat. Wait, sodium already updated to 1.19? No kidding. Thank you, Diplo Thousand, for the 200 bits, letting me know that, bro. Okay, that was fast. And then it allows you to use shaders. I don't know that we'll use, since we've already started this with no shaders, I don't know that we'll switch over to it, but good to know. Um, I, could, I could just install sodium for the sake of, you know, better performance or what have you. But, okay, where the heck is gravel? There's gravel. You like the shaders? Don't worry, there's... I use shaders for plenty of other stuff. Just gonna... I like to keep it consistent. Once we've already started something with a particular style of visuals, I just want to kind of keep it that way. Um, shaders hurt my eyes and make it distracting. It's always two sides to every request. Um, yep, yep, yep. Ramen Lady, thank you for gifting a sub. Tip 11,200 bits. Do you have a chance to talk to MC Pro hosting about a world download? Yes, yeah, 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 that should be in progress. Um, I asked them if they have the ability to host it and it seems like it should be in the works. So I'll let you know when that happens. But yes, I put it on the to-do list and I set the process in motion. Um, Emmerbot, thank you for the 500 bits. Hey Cap, I wanted to ask if you ever intended on playing Delta Rune. Would love to hear what voices you give to the new characters. Maybe at some point, I wouldn't rule it out. I don't know when exactly, but um, yeah, we'll see, we'll see. And Psycho Princess, 16 months of subage. Attacked Universe with four months sporadic subage uh, because I alternate prime subs. Glad to be back for a month. Heck yeah, pretty swick, pretty swick. 
Okay, let me dump out my inventory of anything that we don't need, and then we will we will do the things. Um, did I mention that you should sub to Captain Sparkles too and hit the bell, turn on notifications, follow twitch.tv slash Captain Sparkles, catch these live? I don't I don't remember. I think I I think I mentioned the like button and then I moved to quality content, so I don't know. But uh yeah, you should check that out. It's it's cool. It's super cool. Fun times and what not. All right, Obby can go in there. Let's get ourselves put these boots on and get the nair on. Make the flint and steel and uh, pop off. Okay, cool. Great. All right, I think that's probably good. 53 bread. Will that be enough? Let's top off. I guess I could bring some gapples for safety in case we run into any struggles and um, rock and roll. All right. Uh, let's see. Tip 11 does do it a bit, so you should put on shaders. <laughs> uh, we'll see. I don't think it's going to happen for this, but I'll know for other 1.19 stuff that there is an option now. Um, Okie dokie. It is time. Let us go to the nether. And get, get the more advancements, yeah. All right, everybody, and we zoom. Honestly, if I could work toward, a, I bet you, I've never watched an all advancements speed run because, well, it's eight hours. It's a lot of time to invest. Um, but I would assume that they start off probably by trying to get elytras, beat the dragon, get an elytra because an elytra will help so much with everything else. Negative 526, negative 153. Alrighty then. Um, well, let's see what we can find, everybody. Let's see what we can, ow, frick. Hey, that's cool. Mods folder jarred on. There's no way you just found a bastion that quickly. There's no chance you're you're cheesing it. You're cheesing it, bro. Oh, I don't have a boat. Oh, shoot, dude. Oh, shoot, dude. I don't have a boat. I don't have a boat. Okay, I can actually break things and get them back. I was playing I was playing Death Swap um, randomized earlier today, and so again, I'm in the mindset of, like, everything I break is going to drop something different. Uh, okay, which bastion is it? It is looking like... Oh, also, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get lava, lava for my little brute friend. Oh, get absolutely wrecked, loser. All right, there we go. Um, does it have a bridge unit? Does it have a bridge unit? Wait, that's kind of sticking out there. I don't know. I hope it has a bridge unit. Please tell me it has a bridge unit. That would be very, very great and very nice and very awesome and super cool. So that it has some gold, we would hope. One would potentially hope. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Death Swap with Random Drops with uh, Mr. H-Bomb. It was fun. It was a good time. Video will probably be up next week. We, we did two episodes. First will be Overworld. Second is Nether. And... Didn't really seem super feasible, so we did not do that. Um, but it was it was cool. Yeah, I think it was a it was a pretty cool twist to it. Hopefully, people will enjoy. All right, I'm gonna mine over, I'm gonna mine over to the bastion, or at least try to. Let me just. Oh, hello. Mate? Okay, so this is, this is weird. Like, this is a bridge area coming out, but it's, like, not also at the same time. Like, this looks like a bridge unit, but it's oriented sideways, which is weird. Okay, God, I really hope that a, hope a, a big man does not come and, and drop down on my head. And frick me up. Yeah, dude, that's an advancement. That is an advancement. That's a pretty big place. Pretty big place. Okay, it is a bridge. It is a bridge. Is it a bridge with gold? Is it a bridge with gold? 
Let's see. Let's see. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, yes, it is. Let's go. Frick off. Frick off. Could you not, though, dude? Could you not? Oh, wait. I should return to sender. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Aw. Come on, bro. Come on. Come on. Got him. Okay. Return to sender. Easy. Easy game, easy life. Let's go. Okay, no one's even close, actually. This is sick. No! Dang it. Well, at least there's not lava down there. Okay, they aren't even mad at me. Yeah, this is interesting. Usually the bridge, I feel like, faces that way. And there is more Bastion over there. Huh. Interesting. Okay, anyway. Let's, um, there's a nice little group of mans over there. Let's, uh, let's trade with them. Let's trade with them. Let's see if we can get some stuff, dude. Okay, you're gonna, oh, you're so dumb. So, oh my god, he got wrecked in like two seconds. Okay, hey, my mans, let's go. Come on, come on, yo, you, come on, don't be dumb. There's so much gold in, bro. You guys not seeing what is hap- You guys not seeing? Are you guys not seeing what is happening here? Are you guys not seeing what is happening here? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take out the gold loots for no shiny. Okay. All right. Let's calm down for a moment. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay, we're getting arrows. Oh, we're gonna get so much string! Oh, that's actually dope. We're gonna get so much string that I can then use in order to stop all the vines from falling over and over and over. So, that's great. That's great. That's so great, dude. That's so great. I don't need the water bottle, mate. Soul Speed 2, kinda cool, kinda cool, but. Ahem. <clears throat> Be better on the boots. It would be better on the boots. Oh, who's cutting onions? Let's go. There we go, dude. And we will need to make a respawn anchor. I might as well get some glowstone while we're at it. It's nice that I can go back into the portal and kind of pit stop. Just drop some stuff off so my inventory is not going to be super clogged. Thank goodness the bastion is super close by. Alright. Pearls, thank you. Need more, need more, need more. Alright. Pearls, please. Pearls, please. Don't tell me that all this gold is not going to be enough and I'm going to have to find another bastion. That would be so sad. Um, I'm going to keep leather. Because we're going to need to make some item frames to label chests, potentially. Um, get by to that. Is there anything else of this stuff that I should be holding on to? You think? Hmm. Fire res, obviously, yeah. I wasn't planning on throwing that out. Soul Speed 3, kind of nice, kind of nice. Got a lot of arrows, yo. Okay, five pearls. Um, I have to give the rest. Okay. Please, please do something good for me. And I got a lot of string, which is cool. I've got it. I've received a text message from other people on quality content saying, Need more traffic. Anything that you can do, Captain. Guys, what what do I do to drive more traffic to qualitycontent.com? Go to qualitycontent.com. I'm not doing enough. I'm not doing enough. Ripping pieces, dude. Need to do like giveaways or something like that. 
How do I tempt people? What What is the best way? Advise me. What can I do? What can I do to motivate the, the population? Come on, more ender pearls, please! Gotta start drama. Quality content drama. Why you guys know ender pearls? I'm- you're gonna force me to find another bastion. Oh well, it won't be a problem. I'll find like- probably find like five bastions before I find a fortress anyway. Maid outfit. I mean, how do- how does maid- you're just saying like, make a post with the maid outfit and then say, go to qualitycontent.com? Is that what you're saying? Alright, I don't need those arrows then. But, but qualitycontent.com doesn't sell made outfits, so it would purely be like trying to get attention. Be like, I don't know. No! No, you stupid child. Stupid child. Stupid child. Do not go in the hole. Do not go in the hole, child. Stay away from the hole. Child, stay away from the hole. Do not walk in there. Do not walk in there and steal the stuff. True, true actually, true. Oh, okay, he got the he got that. It's fine. Oh my god, dude, there's just no more freaking uh Well, cool. That was a lot of gold and it got us five ender pearls. Awesome. Buy several billboards. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, let's see. I should have been reading off notifications while I was doing that. Bracklight, with two years, yay, I still have a job. I'm glad that you still have a job. That is, that is good. That is very good. And, okay, well, before I get too sidetracked in here and get killed, potentially. Wait, where did I come in? Oh, gold. Wait, where did I? Oh, I came in there. Um, okie dokie. Oh, wait, it's up there. Okie doke. Yeah, I'm just gonna pit stop, drop some stuff off, clear up my inventory. Clog it again when we have to find more gold and trade with more piglin. Oh, hi there, bud. You're gonna have a- you're about to have a real bad time, man. Um, all right, let's see. And Jenny Pollins, thank you for the sub. Demolin with a sub. Temple of Thousand Two Hundred Bits. Next subathon, Minecraft. But after every X number of subs, the resource pack changes. Yeah, I would need to have a somehow like have a resource pack randomizer, which I have no idea how you would do. Um, so if you want to code it, if you want to code it, go ahead and code it, dude. All right. Oh, here we go. I'm about to do a little bit of. Maintenance here. A little bit of maintenance work. Get these vines out of here. Alright, bird. Now you want to vines obstructing your vision. You're welcome. You're welcome. Wait, frick. Okay. I'll just break that one. I'll just get rid of these ones and... Cool. There we go. So much more free to roam around. Oop. That's better. That's better, dude. All right. Um, we're good. I've decided I've swapped out the iron boots and and made it a, so we have soul speed. And then I put a golden helmet on. And um, now we'll have to find another bastion and find a fortress. So let's fingers crossed. I guess. Yeah. Okie dokie. Where do fathers keep their information? A database. 
Ha, ha, ha. Well, uh, maybe more bastions, because there's no guarantee that the next bastion we'll find will have a, a stash of gold on either the bridge or the treasure unit. So, fingers crossed. And also this time, because we're, uh, we got kind of a central location, we've got to, we've got to ensure that, wait, which way, wait, did I just go the wrong way? Did I go the wrong way? Is this, do I go another, wait, did I go out a different, oh, I went out over here. Um, oh, maybe let me, let me check the other way. Maybe it'll lead us to a fortress or something like that. I thought it was just dead end. First off, ow, God, stupid hitbox. Okay. He just was like, you know, on second thought, no. I've decided to adopt a life of peacefulness. <laughs> I will not attack you any longer. Oh, too bad, bud. Too bad. Okay, okay. Yeah, there is other places. There is other places for me to go. Okay, cool. So where are we, where are we heading to right now? We're heading to <clears throat> the north. So we'll be back to the south to get home. Unless I change directions a little bit or something like that. Um, maybe there's a fortress in this direction. Wouldn't it be crazy if we lucked out and that happened? That doesn't really go anywhere. Nope. And when you're in the Crimson Forest, everything being red always uh, trips you up a little bit. Okay, now we're moving to the west. So maybe it's over here. Watch this dead end, though. It does. It does dead end. Well, shoot. I guess I can just keep going the way that I've been going. Hey, by the way, we're already up to level 24, which is pretty cool. When we finally uh, set up the enchantment table and stuff, maybe we'll be that much closer to um, getting some good enchants and stuff. Oh, sorry about that. My bad. Mm, do I want to get up here somehow? Yeah, here we go. All right. Now we're heading east. I feel like I probably, if I just go that way, I probably end up back where I um, exit where the bastion is. So I could have just gone this way. Okay, nice open area at least. Nice place to wander around. I say that and then I'm probably gonna hit a dead end, but uh, uh, let me get some glowstone. Let me get some glowstone for our respawn anchor. Cool. Wait, how much is it? I can never remember. Is it three glowstone or is it six? It's three glowstone and six crying obsidian, right? Okay, yeah. Oh, there's that soul speed. Love to see it. Love to see it. Okay, fortress. Come on. Show me the money. Show me the money. Show me the money. Give me like a nice, easy... Nice, easy Soul Sand Valley to travel across, please. Nothing super crazy, and then just give me a nice fortress at the end of it. And a bastion, maybe. You know, both of them are right next to each other. Structures have to be separated, though, right? Like, you can't have... Um, you can't have a bastion and a fortress kind of, like, next to each other, can you? Oh yeah, actually, you know what? Don't give me, don't give me a fortress in the Soul Sand Valley because it's just actually painful. It's so bad. It's so painful. Um, can they? JB the Great, <clears throat> thank you for the sub. <clears throat> I guess it's just really rare. I wish she wouldn't do that, man. I wish she wouldn't. I'm used to breaking fire and having it drop a block. <laughs> Why isn't that happening, dude? You can get some cool stuff when you break fire, bro. 
What is that over there? Is that a fortress? That's a fortress! Let's go! Bro, this has been... This has been... Sick! This has been really easy pickings. Usually it's not this straightforward. The only thing that could have been better is if we found a treasure unit and had even more gold than we started off with, so... Um, but yeah. Alright, that's... That's dope. Alright, let's go find ourselves... Um, actually, you know what? We could check the chests in here. And see if, um, oh, you know what we are going to want to do? We're going to want to get some of that. We definitely got to brew things. Get some more of it. That's definitely necessary. Um, I mean, I guess gold is good. One way or another. Spooky, scary skeleton. I think we'll be revisiting for that, honestly. I don't think we're gonna... I don't think we're gonna focus on that until we got fortune, preferably, because otherwise... Actually, you know what? No, last time we were searching for a spooky, scary skeleton, we didn't have fortune. And we got it, like, three in a row. So, um... Yeah. <clears throat> it can't work. It can't work. I Sorry, looting. Sorry. Looting is fortune for mobs. You know what I meant. Fortune for animals. Show us the mods folder. All right, any more chests? I just want to see if there's diamonds. Doesn't look like it. All right, not a big deal. Uh, I'll just collect some more of this stuff anyway. It's not like we're on a server and we need to leave some more for other people. Nope, nope, nope. <clears throat> I'm going to kill a skeleton that's going to drop three heads. That's a five-head strategy. Absolutely. Brick tiles, thank you for the sub. Did you sub because brick tiles? Maybe? Yeah? No? Coincidence? Okay. Anyway, cool. Um, can we go... I think this is where we entered, right? Oh no, this is not where I entered. This is where the blaze spawner is. I actually don't know where I entered and I've probably like completely... Ow, oh, you little mother truck. I actually don't know uh, where I entered here, and I'm totally probably going to be lost, so, oops. No, that was terrible. You didn't like the pun. Not very nice. Oh, um, I do need to get hot tourist destinations, so I need to find... Oh, I, there was a Basalt Delta kind of nearby on the way that I need to just pop into really quickly. You guys don't mind if we pop in on the way home? You know, you, you don't mind, right? Just a little detour. Oh man, dude, when that when that was uh when my mom was like, hey, Jordan, you don't mind? We just need to stop and do one more errand on the way home. I'd be like, no, I wanted to get home and play video games. Come on, I can't take this detour. I had important, pressing, urgent matters. Unbelievable. <clears throat> also, I was extremely contrarian when it came to, um, especially when I was really, 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 really young and we lived in LA, um, I was like, if there was traffic, if there was traffic on the 405, I'd be like, Mom, take Sepulveda. And then if we got to Sepulveda and Sepulveda still had traffic, I'd be like, what the frick, Mom? Get back on the freeway. Always constantly making the most incorrect traffic commuting decisions, Mother. I'm three years old. And I make the best traffic decisions, okay? I tell you to go the other one when it's bad. Come on, dude. What the heck? Okay, where... Where are my blaze rods? I need more. I can't work on these conditions. I would say frick to my... No, I would not say frick. I would say... Fui way, fui way! Sepulveda, sepulveda, sepulveda! That's what I would say. It would be between the two. Um, <laughs> she'd be like, God dang it. She'd actually acquiesce the request, though. <clears throat> yeah, dude, impeccable sense of direction to the three-year-olds. 
three years old. Name many other three year olds who were out like instructing the directions. You know, I was Waze before Waze even existed. Man, I really, if I had, when I was in high school, if I had pursued that passion, I could have been a billionaire. I could have made ways before ways made ways. That looks like, oh, that's not actually danger. Nice. What are you up to? Six? Um, I'm gonna go for a little bit more because we'll need to make a brewing stand and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, if you guys wouldn't mind, come on, keep on, keep on keeping on the spawning, dude. You'd love to see a video of me saying that. I don't think that was captured on video. There were no, there were no cell phones with video cameras at that point in time. There were cell phones, but I believe that they were about this big and primarily lived inside cars. They were kind of car phones, actually. So, yeah. Uh, Mighty Birdman, thank you for the 200 bits. Hold on, hold on, sorry, I'm in the middle of a crazy fight right now. Crazy fight, and it's not even a kindergartner. Never tell me the odds. Okay, we're up to eight, one more, one more. Or we get 10, we just make it a nice, even, easy number. Stop trying to hit me. I should use my diamond axe. I should put it to good use, dude. You were, you're surprised there were even cars when I was three. <laughs> uh, no more dad jokes allowed from you. That was a terrible dad joke. This is a dad joke. Did you hear about the world's largest pickle? It's a really big deal. I have actually heard that one before. So, yeah. Okay, come on. Where the frick the blaze rod at, dude? Unbelievable. Okay, they're being really slow. Come on, guys. Uh, there we go. Oh my god. There we go. That's nine and make it a tenner. Nope, never mind. You're not gonna do that. Super not cool. I have 30 seconds of fire resistance left. Work with me. Work with me, baby. Work with me, please. How many kindergartners could I take down at once? <laughs> Actually, an interesting question, though. Like, how, like, how many, how many kindergartners would it take to incapacitate the mountain? You know, like, how many could he take on? Okay, there we go. Eleven. I wonder if there's any more stuff down here. No. Okay, so I didn't. This is not where I came. Um, I came through here. Where did I? I don't know, dude. No, it's an interesting question, though. <laughs> like, is it more of a teamwork thing? Um, I, I mean, eventually the mountain is going to have fatigue problems, right? So, he's gonna have to deal with that. Okay, so this is where we approach. We approach from that direction. Whereas, like, if, presuming it's like an endless wave of kindergartners coming at him, like, eventually, even if he's able to keep fighting them off, he's gonna tire at some point, right? So, at what point is that? And how many kindergartners, is it like all of them at once, or is it one at a time, or like how does it, how does it work? No, it's true, the kindergartners will have poor, poor teamwork and strategy, um, which you have to take into account. But I don't, I, I don't really know, I can't really get too much into the mindset of, of the kindergartner and their teamwork and strategy. Let me just see, um, okay, all we need is warped forest now. You put too much thought into this. I mean, I've, I've just started putting thought into it right now. I've just started putting thought into it. I don't think that's too much thought. I think too much would be if I was dwelling on this for years and I still hadn't reached a solution, but, you know. Ask Ian if I can do it in the next creator clash. <laughs> Presenting the, um, the, the side title fight with the title fight of iDubs versus someone else. And then the, just under that, we have Captain Sparkles versus an infinite wave of kindergartners. Who will win? How many will it take before the ref has to call it? Okay, I really just want to find a warped forest. 
somewhere nearby. It shouldn't be that hard. And I, I do need to find another Bastion while we're at it. Although I suppose I don't have to find another Bastion. Um, I could actually, because we're not in like a rush rush, I could hunt um, for stuff. You know, the thing here is, like, this is actually, there's a lot of directions to go. Usually I'm kind of funneled in one direction by uh, the terrain. But there's like options to explore. There's too much. There are too many options to explore. It's actually annoying because I feel like I'm going to go in exactly the opposite direction of something useful. Um, okay. Bastion and a warped forest is all I really need right now. Hmm. Hmm. Bastion Warped Forest. Uh, Ko Koneko Bean, thank you for the sub. Appreciate that, dude. And make sure that you're following at twitch.tv slash Captain Sparkles. That way, you can tune into the streams live while they're happening, and it's so cool. It's a cool experience. We like the experience. Yes, we do. Okay, Warped Forest? Warped Forest anywhere, huh? Anybody? Anybody got a Warped Forest I could have somewhere? Why? It's just non-stop crimson forest, and that's quite annoying. I'm gonna go back in the other direction. Maybe I'll try to take a branch off. I just don't want to get, like, so far away from the portal that I just completely lose track. Um, Yada, thank you for the 200 bits. I think you could take on at least 70 or 80 kindred gardeners. Thank you for the vote of confidence. I appreciate it. That's a lot. That All at once? Maybe if it was like wave survival, but like all at once, that's a lot. I would be very intimidated by 80 at once. Like that would actually be kind of gnarly. I feel like 80 could do some damage. I think they could do some real damage in those numbers, dude. Um... Hmm. Okay, Bastion, Bastion, Warped Forest. Bastion, Warped Forest. Come on. Come on, dude. Um. Ah. <sighs> no, bad. Cease at once. I do not appreciate. Also, I'm going to need to come back here with a bunch of beds. Unless I get lucky and find a bastion that has some sick uh, netherite in it. Bro. Bro. Okay, this gets terrible to traverse, doesn't it? Hmm. I mean, I could. If I find the warp forest, I could also just... I'd slay Enderman there. So maybe that's maybe that's the priority. It's like I don't actually need another Bastion necessarily. Oh my god, can you frick off? Hey, I will do that. Nah, dog. Nah. Nope. Hello, Mr. Enderman. Um... Can I interest you in... Let's do... Actually, you know what? I'll build a little house here. Actually, I'll just do the... I'll do the umbrella. I don't know why I wouldn't do the umbrella. That's kind of silly of me. Okay. Hey, buddy. Let's go. Uh, Jaden J.A., thank you for the sub. Much appreciated. M. Schusterman with the two of bits. So at age five, a typical child weighs about 45 pounds. Hey, there we go. We got another. Um, so just think, how many times do you think you would throw that kind of weight? Um, it's different, though, because when I'm, when I'm picking up a, a weight, it does not, it's not like fighting back, you know? 
Daft Not Punk, thank you for the three months of subage. Like, in theory, I could pick up that weight a lot of times, but, yeah. All right, we got another, got another Andy man, another Andy man down here. Hello, mate. How are you doing? Hey, hello, hello. Come here. Hey, 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 hey. Come on, come on. Let's go. Uh, Yada, 300 bits. A more important question is would you rather take on 10 Jardin sized kindergartners or 30 uh, kindergartner sized Jardons? Well, I mean, obviously, uh, the Jardon sized kindergartners, because assuming that they still have the kindergartner stats, like, I'm not gonna, that would be, I would be way more terrified of even tinier versions of, I'm already kindergartner sized though, so it's probably, that's not even the right comparison to use. Um, yeah. But even, it's like tinier version, number one, let's go, number one. Uh, even tinier versions of myself would be, in theory, quite horrifying if they had the same strength. To have, like, a little tiny, tiny version of me who is, like, super, like, super strong for their size would be, like, horrifying. I cannot believe that we have not found a warped forest yet. Um, oh, 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 frick, frick, I don't, mmm, I don't know why, why didn't I, ah, why didn't I bring it in, why didn't I bring in a fishing rod and why didn't I grab a fungus? Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, that's frustrating, that's frustrating, well, shoot. Let me get some of this. The umbrella trick never works for you. They always vanish. Uh, if you look too high up at them, if, like if you look at their eyes again, they will sometimes do that. Otherwise, I don't know if you're playing in like 1.16.1 or 2, but there were bugs. There were bugs in that version that actually caused the Endermen to, to um, teleport when they shouldn't have been. So, um, I have really gone and found another fortress before I found another bastion? Are you kidding me right now? How does that happen? What? 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 I don't even need the other fortress. I don't even need it. This is unheard of for me. This is unheard of for me. What in the world? Oh, fortresses can have saddles. That is true. I mean, I could look inside it, I guess. God, wh where did we come from? We came from northwest. Oh, I just want to find a... I want to find a warp forest! Uh, for, er, fortresses cannot have netherite. No. Uh, tickle me balls. Thank you for the two months of subage. Do a backflip. I can't actually do that here. Uh, I don't have the space, unfortunately. But, um... Yeah. Yeah. Like in the name, dude. Like in the name. Alrighty, where is that fortress at? Is it just like under right now? It is just under. Um, well, hmm. Let me see. Is it right? Oh, it's right there. Okay, I can get down it. Oh, hello there. Oh, mother truck. It's a fortress. It's one it's a fortress in Soul Sand Dali. I've just realized that this this is not going to be fun. This is not going to be a fun place to. No, I'm. You know what? I've I've decided against this. I've uh I've decided to not do this. I've decided this is dumb, and completely unnecessary, and is simply going to cause me to go through like all of my food, and I I decline. Why are Soul Sand Valley fortresses just nightmarish? Who did who decided that? Oh, 
Okay, and now it's a basalt delta. Man, this sucks. This is stupid. I don't want to deal with this. Also, my boots are getting kind of fricked up. Okay, yeah, that's just Basalt Delta. I'm gonna frick. I'm gonna not. Ow. I'm gonna go elsewhere. Number one or the FaZe Clan logo? You take your pick. It really likes that shape. It's either number one or it could be F in the chat. F in the chat for what's gonna happen if I actually decide to go in this thing because Frick Soul Sand Valley Fortresses. Will he ever get hot tourist destinations? It's just so fitting that the final biome that I need to find is really the only one that could really help me get ender pearls quicker if I don't find a bastion. How fitting. How nice. How swell. Also, I really just want to get out of here so that I can stop eating up the durability on my boots. Please. And I really don't want to die this far out. That would suck so much. We're very, very far away from our entrance. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, this is some broken terrain here. Oh boy, that's death if a skeleton decides to hit me. traveling this way, just trying to see new areas, see if there could be another bastion somewhere, somewhere that I haven't seen yet, but there isn't, and that sucks. No, I don't want you. I don't want you to hit me while I'm doing this. Okay, bye. Um, so Raven, thank you for the three months. Have you got all the different colored wool? I haven't. I'm nowhere near it. Not even close. Not even close at all. Um, Wicca Basket, thank you for the 200 bits. What is the thing you've used to keep track of your achievements slash biomes discovered? Also, how many achievements have you achieved? Um, CTM's AA tool. That is what it is. And hold on. We can, we can just do a little, a little update here really quick. Take a look-see. Um, here it is. We have visited 30 out of 52 biomes, so that's great. We're at a 27% on the all advancements. How very exciting. Alrighty, Swick. Let's build across here. Not dangerous at all. Not dangerous at all. Oh my god, why is this, uh, why is it sticking me in the, dude, I'm just stuck in the Soul Sand Valley biome, and I don't like, I'm gonna have to take my boots off so that they don't break. There, it's Soul Sand Valley as far as the eye can see. This is, I need to get back to Nether Waste, you're kidding me. I whiffed. I'm whiffing shots. I'm whiffing shots. Help me. Man, I wish that soul speed didn't cause you to lose durability. It just, it seems like it wasn't a necessary thing to do necessarily, but, but here we are. Okay, I think I've made it back here, sort of-ish. What are we, yeah, we're kind of close. Kind of close. I think this is kind of the area that I was at before. Um, Codefish, thank you for the nine months of subbing. Pretty awesome, dude. Pretty awesome. Let's see. Is this where I came from? Um, where? Let's see. Where are we going? Okay, we're going... Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is pretty close. This is close. This is close. 
think we see the fortress soon over here. Probably. Maybe. And if not, then... Well, that's also fine. Hopefully it's new chunks. Hello, Mr. Enderman! Would you like to help me with my pearl predicament here? Because, boy, it's frustrating. Come on. Come over here, buddy. If it wasn't for the fact that I need to get ender pearls, I wouldn't be doing this right now. I would just come back with an elytra later and I'd find a warped forest that way. And then I'd be like, oh, cool, we're good. Okay, here is, here's the fortress. Um, this is definitely the same one. But because I need ender pearls, it's like the two things, the two things that potentially get me to ender pearls both elude me right now. Why is that? Why is that? I, I can find neither a bastion nor can I find a, a warp forest? I don't understand. I don't understand. What's going on? It's like, we've given you two fortresses. Usually you don't get fortresses, so... Sorry, you don't get to keep having this sort of luck, buddy. Well, at least I'm not wearing my boots down. Um, let's go this way and see... What we got over here, if we have a crimson forest in this direction, that would be cool. That would be pretty cool. Do we want to go down there? It's kind of scary, kind of scary. No, let's stay high. Can always boat down. Man, I'd really like to, in this episode, get hot tourist destinations or get the ender pearls, but I don't know. That might be too much to ask. Um, boy, oh boy. This is, it's gonna be a pain for me to get back up, but, um, okay, what is it? It's south and then west. In order to get back. Yeah, there's a lot of gold, but it, it's like... It's so much. It is so much gold that you need in order to... Alright, I'm gonna just go crazy. Crazy boat YOLO here. Surely there will be something if I just keep moving in this direction, right? Right? Is that a ruined portal over there? It is. Could get a silk touch or something, I suppose. Just don't really want to have to go through another portal. What is this? We got projectile prot, curse of vanishing, silk touch on a hoe. Blistering melons we can always make later. Everything else is not really interesting for us at all. Warped Forest, for the love of God! A one in four chance. A one in four chance that the next biome is a Crimson Forest, or a Warped Forest, and it's not. It's another Soul Sand Valley, which is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Have I eat, eaten the glistering melon? No, I don't think you can eat glistering melon. It's you'd be eating like too much gold. That wouldn't be very om nom nom for your digestive system. Let me. Oh, it's another crimson forest over there. Good lord, really? It's another crimson forest. Oh my god! Come on, man! Come on, man! Oh, why didn't I bring? Why didn't I bring a, a warped fungus? I maybe I should just come back in, warped fungus on a stick, or something. Is that my only hope? That might be my only hope. Oh my god. Almost. That would have been bad. That would have been bad. I was like, where'd the boat go? Oh, oh Jesus. Oh! 
Almost, almost whacked him. I'm gonna have a, a not super fun time trying to get home, I don't think. Uh, yeah, we were at like negative 500, I think. So yeah, we're, um, we are not super close. Let me grab this just so I can have it. But yeah, this is rough. This is real rough. I'm gonna just keep going. This way. No gas. No gas allowed, okay? No gas, please no gas. I'm gonna panic if I hear that shot. Mm okay. Oh, I could breed hoglins. Oh. I mean, I, it's, we, we spawn inside of a crimson forest where the portal is, so uh, not super concerned about it. Okay. I can just, um... Ow. My legs. Please. Please! Warp Forest, for the love of God! Or a Bastion, I don't really care which. No, you're gonna throw a Basalt Delta at me! How can I find Nether Waste several times? Basalt Delta several times! Soul Sand, several times! No! Not a single... This is ridiculous. I'm I'm over it. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna work my way back home and I swear to god we're gonna find Enderman and we're gonna kill Enderman for getting Ender Pearls and that's that's the end of that. Okay, cool. This is not happening. We'll be back here once we have an Elytra and um Great! It's gonna be awesome. So cool. So cool. I'm excited. Oh my lord. Oh yeah, mushrooms for stews. I could eat the mushroom stew, that's true, for eating all the food. Have I ordered dinner yet? No. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Maybe I should say, screw the nether. And, um, yeah. Okay, well, the, the question is, can I find my way back home, though? Hmm. All right, so now I uh, simply have to figure out how to get back home, and it's gonna be fun, and definitely not dangerous and bad. It's gonna be great, and I'm not gonna fall into a hole with lava in it, and I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die. It's simply not gonna happen. I just... Hope that there's an easier way to get back than to build over an absolutely gigantic chasm that I boated across previously. Oh boy. Maybe I just go up here. Maybe I go up here and then it's gonna then then it's gonna say you have to get back down if you wanna keep going. It's so weird. It's so weird how warped forests have just decided to Cease existing here. Same with bastions. I've always found so many bastions before I find a fortress. Now I'm finding multiple fortresses before I find bastions. It was all too good to be true. We found the bastion and the fortress too quickly. And it was like, we cannot have that. <laughs> that is not okay. Oh, I think this is actually where I came in. I think we're good. We're going to find our way back and then... I don't know, are we going to... Maybe we start making Eyes of Ender. We see the direction that we're heading in. And we use our little uh, speedrun calculation tool. And then, um, wait, is this where I came through? Or is this, did I just dead end myself? Oh, good. This is not where I came in. That's not cool. Frick. 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 Okay, we're actually, uh, we're actually better off going in this direction here. Um, cause negative one, oh wait, oh yeah, 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 wait. Uh, mm, or are we, no wait, well, uh, mm. I could just go this way, since it's more open. And then work my way back to the south. Yeah. The only reason why I'm not pausing and resuming here is because 
inevitably if I pause, I'm gonna end up dying. And then it'll be like, oop. Didn't get to see that, YouTube, sorry. So instead, feel free to look at the, uh, the, the timeline, the bar at the bottom, and you can preview when I exit the nether. If I exit the nether. Will there be a way through here, though? That is the question. Or will I have to mine through the wall for 200 blocks? Maybe I will. All right. Watch me have to mine through the wall for 200 blocks because this is actually a dead end. It's gonna be a solid oof moment right there. Um, okay, so wait, it's 338. I mean, I could, I could, I could, I could be like here and then, and then I would just dig through for 200 blocks. 200 blocks, and then we would make it. Easy. 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 Hello! I've mined and broken through to a place where I've built before. That's great. That's so awesome. And exciting. And that means I can save more Dura on the pickaxe, and we should be nearly there. Yeah! Yeet. One day, one day we will find uh, the place that has a warped forest or another bastion. But until then, I think the portal is right in here. I think the portal is right in here. Yes, it is. There it is. Ooh. I have an impeccable sense of direction. Um... You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make a warp fungus on a stick. God, how many of you guys are walking through here? This is ridiculous. I'm gonna go warp fungus on a stick and then I'll go back in and then, and then, then we have a real chance at finding things. Thank goodness for striders. And I have to do it anyway. That's, it's advancements. I don't know why I didn't think about doing that. It's so silly. And I can also add mushroom stew to my eat list. Let's do that. Cool, big plays, big plays. All right, let me arrange my inventory. Okay, let's make ourselves the warped fungus on a stick. Or have it be weird. Can you please work? Thank you. There we go, warped fungus on a stick. Also forgot the spike ast, so we can do that. And now we can go back in and I'm running out of bread, which is a little disappointing, but I also didn't loot the village that we is over there. So I can always go there and get some more bread if needed. Hey, look, look at what we've done. We need to go deeper. Those were the days, return to sender. Oh, shiny, who's cutting onions? Terrible fortress, into fire, take aim. We've gotten some advancements done today, okay. It's not all for nothing. We've been we've been getting things done. We've been productive. Obviously, these are the earlier enchantments and or earlier advancements. Things are going to get more difficult as time goes by. And there's going to be all that stuff, but it's it's good. It's good. It's great. I'm also bringing other iron boots here. Um, let me just kind of fingers crossed. God, I'm so bummed. I'm so bummed. We uh, had a saddle. We had a or we did, we had a strider with a saddle on it. So um, looking so good in there, and we just didn't have the warp fungus. And we didn't get a saddle inside of the uh, nether fortress, unfortunately. And I'm just a little too scared to do the soul sand one because soul sand fortresses, they suck. And they are literally the worst. Okay, Strider. Strider with saddle. Strider with saddle. Come on. Come on. Tell me you got a saddle, my boy. Tell me you got a saddle, my boy. I know you want a saddle. I know you don't have a saddle. Dang. Would have been sick. Would have been sick. Should have killed the Strider for this. I can't do that. That's so mean, bro. That's so mean. Ow. It's one of the meanest things that anyone could ever do is kill a poor little Strider, dude. I have morals and ethics, and there are some lines that I'm simply not willing to cross. 
That's one of them. Don't test my morals and ethics. Okay, do I want to, like... Oh, God. Do I want to, like, build around the Bastion? I think this could go terribly wrong, but I also haven't been over there before. And I need to find a gas. Um... There's no way that this could go terribly wrong. With a brute dropping down on my head or something like No way. There's no way. Oh yeah, I could have just gone through and, and gone through the bridge unit. Anyway. Hey! Spy Ghast! Is it a balloon? It kind of looks like it from that far away, yeah. Um, oh yeah, lava bucket out. Good plan, good plan. That's smart. That's big smarts. Okay, over in this direction, maybe. Maybe this is where the warped forest will be. You never know. You never know. This seems like pretty smooth travels over here. Maybe this is the way to another crimson forest and another freaking Soul Sand Valley. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable. These things that I'm subjecting myself to here. I'm gonna go down. Do not hit me. Wait, hold on. Okay, we're good. We're gonna find it! I swear to God! We're gonna find this! Okay, it's another nether waste. All right, all right, all right. So you're telling me there's a chance. And what are we doing? We're heading to the north in order to get back. And it's like, so far, pretty straightforward trajectory of travel. Never mind, it's a freaking basalt delta. God dang it, god dang it, god dang it. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just do this here. I'm gonna just do this here. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. That was elegant, dude. That was elegant. Let's go. Come on. Come on, give me another one. Give me another one. You suck. So much. Okay, I really don't want to deal with basalt deltas. I just don't. I don't want to traverse them. Even though, watch. It's going to be like, I have to. The only way to access a warped forest is I have to traverse. I have to conquer. I have to conquer the very thing which I wish to destroy. Oh my god. It really is that. It really is that way. I have to conquer the Salt Bay Delta. God dang it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me, let me see. Let me, I, I totally got sidetracked. Let me see if there are any striders that happen to have a, a saddle on that we can see. Any, any shivery, non-shivery boys actually. Any you guys? Any any not? Oh yeah, there's a, there's a man's over there. A man's over there. Any 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 guys with saddles? Wait, no, no. Man's over there. Man's over there. Got a saddle. Man's over there. Does not have a saddle. Shoot. Dang it. I guess you know maybe it is worth staying in the Nether because I have to I have to do this boat has legs. Gotta get hot tourist destinations. Like, I do have to, I do have to do those, so, maybe I just, maybe I just keep it going, maybe I just keep on keeping on and it'll help me, help me get the Ender Pearls faster. I just, you know, Elytra obviously would be cool, but, and I could get a saddle from, if I wasn't such a coward going into the fortress, but I don't know, I don't know, god, that sucks over there, that really sucks, I don't want to be there. Oh yeah, use the spyglass. That's so smart, dude. That's so smart. I can actually use the vanilla item for what it's me it's meant for. Genius. Actually genius as to why they put it in the game. Bro, I'm so used to Optifine Zoom, the the concept of like doing something else is crazy.
Shivery boys, non-shivery boys, any of you guys? Any you go oh my god, thank you. Oh my god, thank you. Oh my god, thank you. Okay, all right, it looks like it's, looks like it's got a bridge, yes! Oh, that's exactly what I needed in my life. You beautiful thing, you beautiful thing. Absolutely beautiful thing. Okay, there we go, perfect. My, you're mod foldering me on this? You know how long I looked around for another bastion? This is not a mods folder moment, don't you dare. Alright, alright, we got, we got some, some mans, we got some mans in there, this is good, this is good. We need to eliminate you, though. And you. Okay, good. Great. Sorry about that. Wrong place. Wrong time. Nothing personal, kiddos. As it turns out, all of the bone things, they were Fs. They were not first places. Have you got a saddle over there, my boy? Have you a saddle? No, you do not. That's so sad. Hey. Hey, you guys, there's, oh, this is, you know what, this is a party. This is a party over here, dude. Wait, are you guys chilling? Oh, that's a, a tough spot, though. Hold up, hold up, here, 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 guys. Get in there, get in there. And all, here, come on up, come on up. Hey, 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 Come on up, let's go, let's get quad trading, quad trading, quad trading. You guys, quad trading. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Into the, into the pit, into the pit, all of you. Watch out for the brutes, obviously. Uh... Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about right now, dude. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, Ender Pearls. Ender Pearls. Let's get them. Let's get them. Let's get. This is happening. This is happening. And then you know what? If I can get, if I can get all the Ender Pearls, I'll worry about coming back with an Elytra later. Take care of hot tourist destinations. Take care of this boat has legs. Yada yada. Um, we'll be good. It'll be great. There we go. Okay, that brings us up to 10. Whew, it's happening. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. Um, DJ Croft, thank you for the one year. I think you owe me paper. Like a like a diploma, like a one-year anniversary certificate. If only uh, Twitch Twitch needs to come up with um, like play buttons, but for subscribers. Um Six, let's go. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait it out. I'm gonna wait it out, get through this. But that brings us up to thirteen. It would be nice to have like a, one as a buffer or something like that. But you know, you can always hit up an Enderman or something like that. Let's go, dude. All right. In the next episode, um, eight. Whoo, eight. Let's go. Let's go. That's so big. That's so big. Also, I can get rid of the Soul Speed One boots now. That's kind of gross. Don't need those. But, I mean, if anything, Haha ha Potatoes needs the certificate at a, at a, oh my god, 11 and, what are the Ender Pearls? Mods folder, mods folder, show me the mods folder, 11 Ender Pearls here, that quick one before, we only got 7 out of like 3 stacks? Oh my god, oh my god, dude. I swear, a, a brute, a brute better not just drop on my head right now. I just don't want to like waste it, are you guys done? You're done. Oh, you guys, thank you so much. I'll even free you up. I'll free you up, dude. You guys have been utterly, utterly incredible. Okay. I just need to get out of here, dude. Ow. That would have been embarrassing. Okay. All right. This shouldn't be too hard to get back. It was like, it's pretty straightforward. Do I want to go check out what could be in the chest here? I don't think there's anything that would be super valuable to me in here that I couldn't otherwise get right now. Nah, I'm good. Oh, wait, le- Oh, oh. 
Yeah, I guess actually I could check chess. I could check chess. There could be like a lodestone or something. Um, or enchanted gapple. Yeah. All right. Y'all want me to come back later when it's a little bit safer for me or something like that? Hmm. Actually, no, 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 no. It's dude. You know what? I come back when I have an elytra. And then everything, it's like, it's gonna be, dude, once we have an Elytra, we can just pop off every which way. It's gonna be, it's gonna be such a huge upgrade. I'm just gonna, I'm just going Elytra. Boys, I'm just going Elytra. Alright, it was, oh, wait, we came down here. Oop. Oop. Um, oh, I can just, here, I'll get some cords. I'll screenshot cords. There we go. I've got, I remember general directions, and I can always, like, VOD review if I need to figure out exactly where, where to go. But I think we're, I think we're pretty good. And we're gonna need more food anyway. We're starting to run a little low in that department. Um... Okay, this is good. This is good. This is we're we're good, dude. We're so so good right now. Unbelievably good. And I remember my way back out. We're really not that far away from the portal. Life's great. Fight each other. Good job. Good job. <laughs> it worked out great. And I'll just do this. Wee. Just right over here, right? Up the hill. See a gas? Look at it through the spyglass. We already got it, actually, dude. Is it a balloon? We did it. Look, look, look. Is it a balloon? Look at a gas through spyglass. Huge maneuvers. Huge maneuvers. And there is our other bastion. Heck yeah. I don't even Bro, I don't even need to I don't even need to go for you anymore, dude. I don't even need to go for you. Here, we can do it again. Hey buddy. And um actually, you know what? Oh my boots! No! Not my boots. Goodbye. Um, oh yeah, it was just through here. Oh dude, this is so much easier. This is so much easier to get back than last time. Run through the tunnel. Back over here. And we're pretty much home free. All right, awesome. Uh, well, thanks everybody for tuning into this episode of All Advancements 1.19. Make sure to um, follow twitch.tv slash Captain Sparkles. Sub to Captain Sparkles 2 on YouTube. Hit the bell, turn on notifications. Check the playlist in the description. If you missed any of the other episodes or, you know, maybe you're watching this in the future and there's more you can jump straight into after this. And um, also check out qualitycontent.com. Again, new drop for limited time only. The night call drop. Look at Burden. Still chilling. Still alive. Having a great time. And uh, yeah, you can pick this up. Hold on. Full screen webcam. Uh, there it is. There it is. Don't miss out. While supplies last, we've also got the hoodies. We've got the um, joggers with zipper pockets. The, the uh, signature, and then yeah, yeah, here we go. Here's where we're at right now. Um, we are at twenty eight percent of the way through. Once we get the elytra, though, then then we start rattling them off a bit. Then everything becomes easier. We can travel. We can we can do everything. I could I could make the respawn anchor right now. There's, uh, there's stuff. There's stuff that can be done. I spy will hit up soon, and um, we're gonna be we're gonna be cranking them out. We're gonna be cranking them out once we get the elytra. So um, anyway, thank you very much for tuning in. Hopefully you've enjoyed, and um, that's it. See you next time.